What's up YouTube? It's the Fantastic Fragrance Runner here and I'm bringing you a brand new video today and this one is on the top 10 best day daytime fragrances and today's gonna be a little bit of a special video because I'm getting close to 100 subscribers so before I get to that point this is gonna be me sharing a little bit of myself with you guys I mentioned before I work in a fragrance shop so we're gonna incorporate that in today's video so the top 10 list I'm gonna go through it as if you were a customer asking me my my top 10 recommended daytime fragrances and I'm going to sell them to you. So let's begin the list. At number 10 we got Lacoste Blank and this thing is shower freshness in a bottle. If you want to smell clean all day, you want to smell fresh, you don't want to go too crazy off the board, I definitely recommend this one. Then number nine, we got Sean John's I Am King. And this one has a little bit more personality to it. It's got a cranberry note in there that's just kind of tart. It pops out at you, but it eases down and becomes pretty soft. So this is one if you're a little bit more extroverted, you want something to use day to day, you're a social person, you like going out there and engaging people, definitely recommend Sean John's I Am King, number nine. And at number eight, we got Eternity Aqua. And Eternity Aqua is a fantastic fragrance. It's pretty much a mix up of the regular Eternity and Polo Blue. Two fantastic fragrances, champions in the, run um, the running. So pretty much combine them both, you got Eternity Aqua. If you love those fragrances, you'll be bound to love this one. Number eight, Eternity Aqua. And at number seven, we got Gucci Guilty, and this one is fantastic. It is a very mass appealing fragrance. It's got a light, sweet, fruity note in the beginning. It's a little bit metallic, but people love it. It's got that Gucci class, that Gucci excellence. It performs really well. So taking the number seven spot, Gucci Guilty. <clears throat> And at number six, we got one of my personal favorites, Versace Dylan Blue. And this guy is just so versatile. I just had it on my list for the top 10 night out fragrances. So this shows how versatile it is. It would be higher, but this is a very specific kind of range we're aiming for. And while Versace is great at being a daytime fragrance, you know, it's still just amazing at everything else. So it's sitting just fine at number six. And at number five, we got the original YSL Alone. And my bottle is nearly empty, definitely want to pick another one up. But um, this guy is fantastic, it's mass appealing, it's sexy, it's classy, it's sharp, it's fresh. It's got a little powdery note to it, but girls love it. And this is a really good, like upgraded daytime, office to office, day to day fragrance you have right here. YSL at number five. And let's move on. <laughs> so at number four, you got Versace Manny Fresh and um, Mont Blanc Star Walker. And these two right here are among my favorite. They're very fresh. Girls love them. They're amazing to use day to day. So definitely recommend these two. Uh, this one's a little bit more masculine. This one's a bit more of a cross between this and Dolce Gabbana's Light Blue for women. So if you want something a little bit more fruitier and sweeter, um, sweeter, this one and more masculine and fresh, this one. And at number three, you got one that's a little bit more classy, a little bit more elegant, Terre de Hermes. And this is the Eau de Toilette. My bottle's almost done, but I got just a full atomizer left of it here. And this one's fantastic. This is a more kind of mature daytime fragrance, and it's a real big step up from some of the other ones, just because it is sharper, it is for a more um, smaller audience it won't be appreciated by everyone but if you want to step up that class that engagement with a more like business like setting office you know or you're just older in general and you don't want to like mess with Versace Manny Fresh Tejere de Hermes fantastic recommend trying that one out number three spot and then at number two whoops <laughs> I'll get that in right there so at number two, we got Dolce Gabbana's Light Blue for Men. And this one's fantastic right here. It's um, another one of those mass appealing citrus scents. Ladies love it, guys love it. People will love it on you. If you go to the shop, the lady, the cashier over there will compliment you on it. It's just, you know, it's world renowned at this point. It's got its many variants. Dolce Gabbana Light Blue, definitely deserving of the number two spot. And it's really hard to top. But let's move on to number one. Pop that right there. 
<clears throat> and at the number one spot, we got Giorgio Armani's Aqua De Gio. And this is indeed worthy of the number one spot. This is the world-renowned Aqua De Gio. It has been the champion for decades for a reason. It really just takes people to a different place on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, everybody loves it. Its formula is complex still to this day. They got the Profuma version out now that drops it down to just five ingredients, but this one is still a champion in its own right. So definitely recommend everybody trying this fragrance at least once in their life. Give it a good run, like kill a bottle of it. Even if you don't like it at first, just keep using it until you get those compliments, until you get that love. You know, just spread it. It's worth it. It's awesome. Aqua de Gio, number one spot. And that's the list guys, I really, really hope you enjoyed. Um, this is all one take, so of course it's gonna be more, you know, goose than normal. But um, yeah, I hope you guys had fun. Um, and leave a like if you enjoyed the video, comment with any thoughts below, and thank you guys for subscribing. You know, you guys have absolutely been crushing it and really been supporting my channel and helping it grow. So this has been you know, a fun little video for you guys to kind of see a little I guess more personal side of me, but you know, I appreciate all the love and I'm wishing all of you guys to stay fresh. And this is your Fragrance Runner signing off now.